Amy Medford with Medford Knife and Tool. Knives on the Table are headed to Cato Group, aka Knives and Tools. These are being shipped to the Netherlands. Um, Cato Group has multiple facilities, but the Netherlands is kind of their uh, home base, so to say. It's where we ship everything to anyway. Nick Floor, hello, how are you? He's my contact there. I've met Nick at a couple of the SHOT shows over the years. And um, they really have grown and blossomed and they do very well in Europe for us. And we're ever so grateful that they're there. Um, that's probably all the information you need. Again, if you go to our website and go to the contact, um, not, not the contact page, but our um, factory direct resellers page, you can type in where you are in Europe and it'll give you a listing of everybody that uh, carries our knives over there. And in the meantime, let's take a look and see what we have headed their way. Panzer, man, this is one of my favorite configurations for the Panzer. It is all blacked out with flamed hardware. And the boys even flamed the thumb stud. I don't see that very often, but I'm sure they wanted to uh, kind of darken it up a little bit. It really does add a cool little um, icing on the cake, so to say. I love the thumb stud on this. It really is does help facilitate the opening of the knife. That's what it's there for. And... The nice thing about the thumb stud on the Panzer is it's reversible. You can pull it out and put it on the other side. And if that's the closest thing to a left-handed carry, unfortunately, that we offer. S35VN, so blacked out with flamed hardware. We have the Gentleman Jack here. And we have multiples of these headed out. So if you just love this knife, as you should, small, very transportable. It's a nice European EDC knife. Um, there are multiples of this, and it has the new tumbling process. So you see that shine on the blade. You can see that made in the United States is very clean and crisp. Praetorian Slim Flipper. This is a filigree laser pattern we do in-house. S35 tumble drop point blade with blue handles. The infraction, black and bronze. So PVD blade, handle spring breaker a brushed bronze clip, and bronze hardware. Midi Marauder. Again, there's two of these. I think it's very smart that they ordered two of each. Faced violet anodized handle, PVD drop point blade, PVD hardware, which includes the spacers, and a kind of a matted out, bead blasted violet spring is a nice complement to the shiny handle. Proxima. Faced in bronze, tiger stripe, flamed handle, PVD blade. And this is one of my favorite configurations now. It's a PVD spring, and you can catch the bronze pinstriping. It brings in the bronze from the handle really nicely, and a brushed and flamed clip. 187 drop point, all titanium. Lovely bronze to violet fade, matted out, so bead blasted, flamed, Hardware. Again, you can see the spacers, brushed and flame clip, that popsicle style clip. And then the last 187 drop point is just like the Proxima. Faced in bronze tiger stripe flamed handle. And we just went bronze on the spring. There's the over travel. Again, you're gonna start seeing this on almost all of our folders moving forward. And there's that pinstriped PVD clip. Just a beautiful little flourish to the night. Okay, so all of those are headed to Nick and the boys at Cato Group in the Netherlands. Reach out to them and keep watching the videos. Till the next time, I'm out.